Hello, welcome to the Amatrol Classroom. I'm Jason Everett. I'm one of the regional managers here at Amatrol, and I'm here today to talk about the Skill Boss Manufacturing Training System. Now, this was designed with the help of the Manufacturing Skills Standards Council, MSSC, and it was built to align to the CPT certification, Certified Production Technician Certification. And if you know anything about that certification, there's four modules to that quality, safety, manufacturing processes, and maintenance awareness. This system is designed to do about 50 to 60 hands-on skills that relate to that certification. So what this is, is a mini mechatronics line. We have a, a, a control panel here that's running a drive system that's polishing blocks. We have aluminum blocks and acrylic blocks. And I'll load this up into the system. We also have all the, the pneumatics piped out to the front end, all the electrical piped out to the front end, disconnects and all that. So if we start this up, you can see that it's a polishing system. We're loading blocks onto the system. We have a pneumatic three-axis robot here that is loading and sporting the blocks by type and if they're good or bad parts. So, so you can see that an acrylic part right there and it's bad um, like I said the drive system this is all mechanical drive so the students would learn uh, belt tensioning belts and chains alignment shaft run out coupling standoffs pillow blocks lubrication all those er topic areas that relate to mechanical drives they're going to do hands-on skills that relate to those. Also, hands-on skills that relate to the safety module. There's lockout, tagout, both pneumatic and, and electrical. There's also, it's also machine guarding, PPE. We cover that uh, quality. Uh, we're going to have students measure, take measurements on the Skill Bus Manufacturing Trainer, uh, take measurements of the blocks, take measurements of components. When we get into manufacturing processes and maintenance awareness, we're going to look at cycle times, how to increase, decrease cycle times. Has a true HMI here, um, so students will learn to navigate an HMI as a variable frequency drive, so we can vary the speed of that motor by making adjustments to that variable frequency drive. Also have the PLC built in here. Um, so when we get to uh, maintenance awareness, pneumatics, students are gonna learn skills on pneumatics, electrical systems, different types of sensors, magnetic read sensors, limit switches, inductive, uh, reflective sensors. What we see here is the Skill Boss 1. That means it's Skill Boss, uh, the first system comes with a Siemens suite, so we have a Siemens HMI, a Siemens 1200 PLC, uh, but we also have available the Skill Boss 2, which is an Allen Bradley or Rockwell suite. So uh, 523 drive, uh, panel view HMI, and uh, uh, micro 820 PLC. So that's it from the Amatrol classroom, Skill Boss Manufacturing. Again, Jason Everett, thank you for your time.